Hey guys, so we have four squares right here. Three of them are inside of this larger one. It gave us the area of the blue square 16, the area of the red square 64, and the area of this orange region, which is just a part of the larger square, is equal to 208. And the question is, what is the area of this green square? So let's rewrite this as an equation. If we take the larger square minus the blue one, minus the green one, minus the red one, that should equal 208. Since I don't know the side lengths of the larger square, I'm gonna make them both X. So I know that the side length of this blue square is equal to four, and the side length of this red square is equal to eight. Eight. The side length of the green square is going to be this whole x minus 4 minus 8, which is x minus 12. So the area of the larger square is x times x, which is x squared. The area of the blue square was given as 16. This green one, this base is x minus 12, and the height is x minus 12, so it's going to be x minus 12 squared for the area, and the red one's going to be 64. All this is still equal to 208. To get rid of this minus 16, this minus 64, I'm going to add 16 and add 64 on the left side. And to counterbalance that, I'm going to add 80 on the right hand side. This left hand side, all all these cancel, leaving us with just this. And on the right hand side, 208 plus 80 equals 288. So this piece right here, we can bring down and distribute it out. X times X is X squared. X times negative 12 is negative 12 X. Negative 12 times X is negative 12 X. And negative 12 times negative 12 is equal to 144. Negative 12 X minus 12 X is equal to negative 24 X. We can get rid of this stuff and bring this up here. Let's put parentheses around it. And then we'll bring down our X squared minus, and that's still equal to 288. Bring down the X squared again, and let's distribute this negative. So be negative x squared, positive 24x, and then minus 144. And that's all equal to 288. So next, let's add 144 to both sides. After all this, all we have on the left side is just 24x. This x squared minus x squared went away, and this negative 144 plus 144 went away. And then 288 plus 144 is equal to 432. To solve for x, we divide both sides by 24. 24x divided by 24 is x, and 432 divided by 24 is equal to 18. We now know that these x's up here are equal to 18. So now to find the area of the green box, we knew that was equal to x minus 12 squared, but we can plug in 18 for the x. 18 minus 12 is 6, 6 squared is 36, and that is the answer to our question. How exciting.